What's up guys, it's me the Fanatic and welcome back to another episode, I believe it's part 5, of my Pokemon Alpha Sapphire Egglock. Last episode we changed up the team a bit when we got a Riolu, a Horsey, and a Apom in an egg, which has reminded me we need to go and look at that Apom because I haven't looked at it yet. Um, and we also took on Brawly, the Jufa Gym Leader, and won thanks to Luchet yet again doing lots of work. So let's have a quick look at this thing. It's Impish with uh, Pickup. Pickup would be quite nice. Let's be honest, it would be quite nice. Slam. Is that a normal move? I guess it might be an egg move. Um, so that's the Apom. And we've got these guys in the wings. So there are spare Pokemon. So we've, we've got a pretty good position yet. No one's died. Then again, I'm not anticipating anyone to die for quite some time. However, like a battle against my oh my rival battle. Who did I pick? Torchic. Son of Mudkip. Um. Okay. Marsh Tomp could be a thing. Could be a pain. Do I want to battle you? I guess I do. Let's try Minchino because I haven't tried it yet. Although I haven't tried half my team other than a. Uh, other than uh, Holucha. I was born in a village far from the sea, so I've always dreamed of coming to Hoenn. More more hints. I wonder if there's a hint in this in 4th gen remakes, like there was a hint in um, X and Y, like a remake of this. Slack off! Okay. I see what you're doing here. I expect this double slap is going to kill him, or do a lot of damage anyway, because that Silk Scarf and... The You've got to be kidding me, right? I didn't do anything. Well, it's going to be five hits, but I'm now going to fall asleep. Perfect. Absolutely wonderful. Well, the Slackoff will, like, not be able to attack because, yeah, Tron. So I could stay in and uh, get all these, uh, get all the experience for myself. Come on, Minchino, wake up. Please, Encore. Okay, at least this guy doesn't want to attack me. I received an Encore. Look at him, he's too cute. That's why he got an Encore. Oh my god, I'm going to get that five turn sleep, aren't I? I can already see it. I can already see my five turns. Oh, turn three? Come on, Minchino. Come on, wake up. Alright, Tron is going to activate again. Thank you. Double slap hit this time. Thank god. Could have been a different story if I actually flipping hit it the first time. Four. Alright, that's dead. It only took me nine slaps to kill a bitch. You would not want to mess with Minchino in a club. Try hit on a Minchino. Patches are a little 13. You grew up with a raging seas, don't you? Or didn't you? Um, honestly, I don't know. I don't know where I came from. Stork probably carried me here. That Fisher can just... Yeah, we'll just leave that Fisher. Right then, Granite Cave. Normally the cave's blocked off, but we didn't even bother go looking. Because I knew it would be blocked off. Of course we find a Pokemon just in front of the door. Of course. Another Zubat, or a Troll Bat, or Fat Bat, whatever you want to call it. Minchino. Could take this thing on. One on one. I'm going to run, because why not? Okay. Let's go find Mr. Steven in Granite Cave, shall we? Let's waddle and appreciate the panoramic camera view thing. <gasps> 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 Dun dun dun! Added so added sound effects. Sixty nine out of ten would bang. Would bang my sound effects. Stephen looks very perplexed. And we had that for nothing. Oh no, it's walking on saying okay. Mm hmm. So in the ancient world, their primal forms once held this much power. The super ancient Pokemon. What terrible strength! But this appearance here, it seems somehow different from Mega Evolution. Hmm, it seems my question will not be answered today. Hmm? You are? I see. It's a pleasure, May. My apologies. My name is Steven. I'm interested in rare stones, so I travel here and there. Today my journey brought me here. But what about you? Oh, a letter from me. Or for me. May gave Steven the letter she had been entrusted with. I thank you. It must have been some trouble to track me down. I suppose I must repay you in some way. Let me see. I'll give you this TM. Please accept it. It contains my favourite move, Steel Wing. Very nice. Nice TM to get. 
especially with fairies in the game, it has very much more of a use. However, I don't know, I, mean, I assume Horlucha can probably use it. Horlucha, I just called it Horlucha, didn't I? Isn't that, no, wait, that is his name. Oh, I don't know, just, oh, never mind. Uh, if you don't mind me asking, do you feel anything particular when you look up at this wall? A primal world lost thousands of years in the past. A legendary Pokemon of tremendous power became humanity's greatest threat. The terror aroused by that power is clear to see in this ancient artwork. Yes, but not all power is terrible. Your Pokemon are clearly capable as well. Looking at you all together, I think that you have it in you what, to become what? <laughs> to become the Pokemon League champion, as long as you keep training, that is. Good luck to you. I must be doing I must be going now. Look at these paintings. Should we... Should, whoa, look at that. Let's look at it. It's a cave painting depicting a giant Pokemon-like creature wreaking havoc. There is a symbol assembling an alpha on each of the beast's two arms. How interesting. Hmm. Let's leave this part of the cave and let's bump into ten Zubats on the way out. I don't want to sprint because running makes it more likely to find a wild Pokemon. Well, we made it that. We made it up there. Oh my god, guys. Oh, I was going to say our pro sneaky skills. Never mind. What's it going to be? It's a Zubat. I told you it would be a troll bat. Called it. Called it already. Minchino. Oh, why can't he be wearing a scarf like I'm making him hold? That'd be cool if, like, they held the item. So, like, you could see the Megastone on a Pokemon, like, as a necklace, like they do in the anime kind of thing. Ah, never mind. Right, let's go. And we can actually now head on to a uh, uh, Slateport. But remember there was a bit of a, there was, like, a route I said you can go to over here. Route 107, we can catch another, what is most likely going to be, Tentacle with our old rod and exchange it for a Pokemon. So let's give it a go, see what we find. Let's go to this, let's old rod. Horsey has fallen behind on the levels, man. Am I going to catch it? Nope, nothing seems to be biting. Okay, where's my suction cups when I need it? Let's try again, shall we? I was going to say, where have I lost my... I've lost the key item, but it was the letter I gave to Steven, that's why. Nice and catch. Right, be a tentacle, or a magic up. I haven't found a magic up yet, which is interesting. Tentacle again! Right, Minchino. Um, you're probably not what I wanted to lead off with. Scratch will probably kill it. Let's go into Lance, Thunder Wave, and proceed to try and catch this thing. But whatever hatches will only be level 5 again. Poison Sting. Okay. Don't poison. Thank you. Thunder Wave. Let's go. And I can twist to this thing. Look at that. Ah, oh, that's a really nice background, actually. And I like how the sunset effect is there as well, based on the time. Twister. I mean, it is half eight. I'm pretty sure my voice just broke again. I'm going to stop after this. This is the fourth episode. I'm recording in a row. Because I know I might not have enough time. I need to do some adult chores tomorrow. So... I'm going to chuck a Pokeball at thing because my luck was good the first time around. Look at your teeny face, it's so, oh, it's so cute. Right, let's catch this tentacle. The third tentacle it'll be. We've caught one, two, three, four. Thank you. Tentacle was caught. 47 experience, not quite enough to level anyone up. That's a shame. Oh, right, look, I don't want to look at any more town. I'm getting sick of tentacles. Box 4. Let's go change him for an egg quick and then we'll head off to Slateport where we can also get some more Pokemon fishing. Uh, I don't know if you can actually get Pokemon physically in Slateport. But then there's also the route above Slateport where we can catch something. So let's see what we hatch from another egg, shall we? Let's um, go back to box 1. Let's quickly put... Um, I want to keep Riolu in the party because happiness obviously helps. So let's go over and get a Pokemon from this box. Let's take that one. That egg is mine. Where'd you go? You're there. Nope, not. Didn't mean to do that. Right, what hatches from this egg? Be something good. A fire type would be lovely right now. Especially for the next gym coming up. Like a Nummel, especially. That'd be cool. It is a. <laughs> it's a Scatterbug. Okay, I was bound to get a bad Pokemon at some point. I would like to give a nickname to the newly hatched Scatterbug. I could do. What should I call it? I'm tempted to call it Butterfree, just for a laugh. Vivion. I'm going to call you Louis Vuitton. 
There is no advertising, and my spelling's going to be horrible. Uh, don't have to say spell it, but it'll do. I was not paid to advertise. I would like to say that because there is some stupid rule now saying you have to advertise. Louis Vuitton did not sponsor my video. And if they were going to, I'd at least appreciate if they sent me some clothes. Although I'm pretty sure it's all female, isn't it? Whoops. Right. Are you egg... You're modest. So actually, you have been purposely bred. Oh, wait. I need to level you up. It's level 5, so you're not even going to evolve, are you? God damn. But hey, something in reserves. It would be another flying type. Uh, oh wait, I thought I'd given another rare candy to Mincino then. Alright, let's get you up to level 5. I wonder if he doesn't... Does, if, does it not get any egg moves then? I guess, I mean, like, you couldn't, like, I don't know, for example, air slash. I'm pretty sure it learns air slash, but... I guess it makes sense for it not to be able to learn it. But Vivian can. Hmm. That's just me rambling on about some rubbish, really. Right, let's deposit this guy into the spare box. Um, you go there. And you're done. Right then. Let's head on to Slateport. I think we've pretty much completed everything we could complete in, in Dewford. So, let's go on to the next town. Oh, oh so it looks like you delivered that, uh, your chit. Bryony, stop chucking made-up words at me. First it was belay, and now it's... Whatever. Route 109! New Pokemon route. No valid data again. It's only when... It's only on the ship when it comes up saying there's no valid data. So I hope you guys can actually see this, because... <coughs> I can see it on XSplit. So I assume it's recording it. Ahoy, we've made land in Slateport. I suppose you're off to visit Captain Stone and deliver those Devon parts. Indeed I am. Let's go. And battle all these trainers on the beach, I guess. I've laid anchor in port around the world, but Slateport is the best. Interesting. Interesting to know. You are challenged by Sailor Huey. Machop. Am I leading off with Minchino? I am, aren't I? Yeah, that, 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 that's, that's not good. That's just, it's really not good. Okay, then. Or Lucha, where are you? I need you. Let's wing attack! I need to, someone's gonna die. I've gone too long about any bad things happening to me yet. Seismic toss. That could be troublesome, but wing attack will kill. Oh, aerial ace! Sorry, I don't know wing attack anymore. I learned aerial ace, didn't I? Last video. And that's a dead machop. Thank you. And uh, not enough to get a level 17. Minchino grew level 15, though. Encore. That could be quite handy, I guess. Let's... What have we got? Helping hand. I'll forget helping hand. Encore could be helpful. I wanted to learn something that isn't... I'm pretty sure it learns wake up slap. That could be handy. I'm already level 13. Icy wind. I, I think it's more powerful than powder snow, anyway. 40. 55. Alright, I'll forget Growl. We've got we've got a stab. We've got like dual stab going on here. Icy Wind, Rock Throw, Powder Snow, Aragogby level 9. And Leer. Yes, that's definitely what I was waiting for. Sailor Huey. You're the best. Oh thanks, man. I know, I know I didn't need to be told, but I already knew I was the best. Why don't you give me the soft sand? Give me. Our cast was taking a long time. Oh, uh, it's not. I don't want to know any more about your goddamn castle. I'm on soft sand. You can have this. Thank you. We're going to get all the sand from the beach and make a ginormous castle. Then we're going to be king and queen. You can be a servant. Why, thank you. I think it's a person over here who gives you an item. You. It's you. All the water around these parts is clean. But my Sigsagoon still picks up litter from the shoreline at times. Dirty water becomes rain and joins our rivers, which we drink from. If we pollute the sea, it all comes back to haunt us eventually. Okay, he doesn't give us an item. Fair enough. You, battle me. Doesn't be a beach umbrella look like a giant flower? No, it looks like a giant umbrella. God, kids these days. Azuril. Oh, Azuril. You're not going to know what's hit you, buddy. Minchino silk scarf. Double slap. Let's go. Skill link. Let's see how much this does. Probably not much. Oh my god, I've done nothing. Come on, Minchino. Oh, oh, is this gonna be? A f is this gonna be a kill? No, it's gonna live barely. Oh, God damn! 
How unlucky have you got to be? Never mind, he only went for water sport. Fire's power was weakened. Right, pound for the win. Nice, and tail! I want to learn tail slap. That's more powerful than double slap by a country mile. What's your team? Who should I... I'm going to try someone new. I'm going to put Riolu on top. I think Riolu might benefit from some screen time, as well as a Maura, though. That's the thing. None of them are really, like, in a position to help. If Riolu evolves into Lucario, that, before the next gym, that'll be helpful. I'm first, yeah, I could go for a soda pop at the seashore house. Could you? Could you really? We're challenged by Chiba Ricky, Zigzagoon. Well, I wish I knew some fighting type moves at this point. I'm pretty sure he patches lens force palm at like level 15 or something. I have crunch. Um, I have prankster as well, but I can't benefit from it. All right, let's try a crunch. How much does this do? I'm pretty sure this is Zigzagoon knows surf actually. Oh, wow, I've done a lot. Wow, Riolu, you're powerful, man. Sand attack. Okay, don't miss this next crunch, please, Riolu. Please hit. Don't miss. Baby doll eyes. Of course, crunch should still kill. Because I dropped his defense. Yeah, it did. Okay, I had bullet punch anyway, so I could dodge the next set of baby doll eyes. 168. Oh, yes, level 14. I wonder, is Riolu classed as a baby Pokemon? Because I don't know if it grows really quick because of it. Lance Rue level 13. You check Rue level 17. And that was it. <laughs> May receive 56 Pokey dollars for winning. Are there any more trainers on this beach? You look like a trainer to me. Uh, battle with me? Okay, let's battle. Challenged by Sailor Edmund. Wingull. Who am I using? Patches. Uh, yeah, I'll see. I don't think this thing has any flying type moves yet. Crunch. Get that defense drop again, Riolu. You know you want to. Wow, that's a lot. Missed. Missed. Come on, I wish there was a challenge mode on this. I love the fact they put it in Pokemon Black too. Why did they take it out again? It was it was an option. It wasn't forced upon people, so what was the point of taking it out? That's my rant. That's my rant. Why did they take challenge mode out? What's next? Eric got level 10. Machop. Okay. Um going to Luchette. Because I can't touch anything. I can't touch Machop with anything other than Luchette. Oh, I just remembered I can change. I can change nicknames of the Pokemon I need to do now. So now's the time to think of a nickname for... Who did I forget to nickname? It was Minchino, wasn't it? I'm going to call it... I don't know what to call it. What should I call it? Minchino. I know what I'll call it. I know what I'll call it. It's fine. Sailor Edmund was defeated... <laughs> Terrible sound effects. Terrible sound effects. Um, that's the town. I don't want to go in there. I want to battle this woman. Nope, she doesn't battle. Let's go in this beach house and win ourselves some soda pop, because why not? Battle these trainers in here instead. I'm going to show you how great my Pokemon are, but don't cry. Don't cry. I am insulted. So we sent out Azuril. You will probably not appreciate... You're a... F Is he fairy? I don't know. I assume he's a normal fairy. Let's bullet punch, see what happens. Are you a fairy? You are a fairy now. Okay. Bubble Beam. Oh my god, I'm so, so devastated. It's going to do so much. Oh, of course he gets the speed drop. Why does Bubble Beam slow people down anyway? I don't get that. Never mind. Bullet Punch is a 2 hit KO. Oh, so close, Patch. So close. I lost, but I won't cry. No, you, you said you were going to make me cry. You have to cry now. Alright, next trainer. Sailor dude, look at me sitting down. I'm on the lookout for a battle with the seashore ha Oh, you'll find no hotter trainer than me. Well, I'd give you a solid 6 out of 10. You miss leg day. You're pretty ugly. Tentacool. Crunch should do a good amount of damage here. Because these things aren't physically defensive. So, Crunch. How much is this going to do? Nah, ha, ha, ha. That's my impression of me crunching. Ooh, so close. Toxic... God damn spikes. Okay, well, Bullet Punch will kill. So, in case he somehow out-prioritizes me, let's go for Bullet Punch. Oh, I love whoever bred this. I have a feeling I know who it was. 
I, I have a feeling it was a certain Mr. Powers that bred me this Rioni. Are you can land Force Palm? Yes, you are! Thank you. Stab. Finally. Forget. We can forget. Endure. Actually, I could have forgotten Quick Attack, because I already have uh, Bullet Punch priority, so... Which will be Stab, eventually. Machina Grid level 16. Perfect. Machop. Okay. Have I got anything Poison type? I haven't, have I? Luchette is flying, so it should ignore the top six spikes, right? I'm just going to stay in. Go for a Force Palm. Hopefully I don't get a uh, Paralysis and he gets... Oh, that's Quick Attack! Never mind. Oh, I've done a lot of damage. That was a crit, that's why. Alright, he's Focused Energy. I don't even know if a crit Karate Chop will take me out or anything from there. So, Force Palm, how much is this going to do? Oh, it's not quite a kill. You got... Why would you go for another Focus Energy? Why would you do that? Bullet Punch for the kill. And that's a dead Machop. Good game, Riolu. I want Riolu to hurry up and evolve into Lucario. I love Lucario so much. I could even... Oh, no. I, I was going to say, I could have a Mega on my team. But, the Mega Stone for Lucario is like... Defeat all contests, or win a Masterclass contest or something. Which I guess isn't too hard, but... I ain't got the time to do that. Hell no. Right then. Plus, actually, it probably would be completely broken that uh, Lucario. So, patches. Let's take down this Goldeen. I'm going to have to switch it up, I think, for the next battle. Because, oh, why did I not Force Palm? It's Stab. It'll do more. Wow, I've done nothing. Flail. Well, that could be quite scary. Wow, I've done a lot. Force Palm. Hmm. I want to say I don't know if Force Palm will kill. Flail could do a lot. Let's go. Let's try Force Palm. Get the paralysis. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no 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 no. Oh my days. Quick attack now. Quick attack. For the kill. Thank you. Got reckless. I got reckless. That was close. Now, please evolve. Aragog Greed level 11. I'm going to put Aragog on top because he hasn't seen the screen at all yet. And no, you're not going to evolve because the music came back. Oh, God damn. Your happiness must be quite high, Patches, surely. Let's put Aragog on top. I need to heal Patches up with my potion. I have 12 of them. <laughs> I love how they just give you so many potions. Um, Machino, you know what, I probably don't even need to heal up that many people. Right, let's battle this woman here. The burger I ordered is taking forever, to make him feel totally crabby. What is that music, that intro music to this battle? Wow, that was like deep. Challenged by Delinquist Destiny. That is a black woman name if I've ever seen, oh no. Humph. Humph. Humph, this thing is annoying. She's level 15. Um, can't touch it with Minchino. Can't touch it with... Well, I can touch it with... Luchette. This thing's a massive threat. I'm going to go into Luchette. I want to take it out quick. Sableye is annoying. Just Sableye is just so annoying. Let's see what it does. I have a berry as well, so safe switch. Detect. Predictions. Aerial Ace. Now he detects. I should have roosted. Should have used roost. Never mind. You can't keep doing this to me, Sable. I do not use it for a third turn in a row. You mad, bro? You mad? Oh, I didn't even do that. Right, you're going to detect again. I'm going to home claws. Oh, he doesn't detect this time. Now watch me go for the aerial ace on the next attack and astonish. Okay. Watch him go for the detect again to be a complete noob. Should have, should have home claws. Should have used that home claws. Airy lace. Thank you. You're not detecting again, are you, Sableye? Thanks. You're dead. Hallelujah. And we get what? Four hundred. Wow. Four hundred twenty-seven. What is going to get loads? Level twelve. Oh, and that's it. Oh, Lance level fourteen. And we defeated Destiny. 
the black woman in a white body. Right, so let's go for this guy. What have you got for me? Hey, 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 what's with the deal? Are you after my snow cone? No, I'm not after your snow cone. I want to battle you. You are challenged by Street Fighter Blair. Puchiana. Ah, oh, that's been perfect for uh, Rioli. Aragog. You know what, let's see how much these bubbles... Uh, bubbles can do nothing. It's level 12. That's level 12. I'm faster. How much does that do? Wow! That wasn't even a crit! Of course he's got power! Bubbles just... Or, or to be fair, Poochyen is just... One sand attack and you miss. One! Oh, come on. No, Aragog. All oh, right, we took that pretty well. Um, we should be able to live crit. All right, we hit bubble this time. Thank you. As a dead Pucciana, perfect. Eric, you can get some good experience. 144. I love how this thing is flying, despite not being able to fly. <laughs> it's levitating in thin air. I love it. I love horses. It's a Pokemon. It's brilliant. Right, Riolu. I know this Caravana is going to get rough skin damage, but actually, oh yes, fighting type is going to be really helpful against uh, Aqua Jet. Welp. Okay, that's fine. Force Palm this thing to death. Rough skin. It's fine. And Caravana fainted. Perfect. Patch is getting 183 experience. No, no one grew a level. Where did you come from? Right then, guys, we are going to go claim our soda pop because we did beat all the battles. I'm the owner of the seashore house. You can call Mr. C. Wow. Creative. You're scorching hot. Those battles blazed. I'm more than impressed. Right, guys, that is going to be the end of the episode today because I'm finally going to keep it short like I want to. Because I don't want to go and do the uh, Team Aqua a bit in Slateport straight away and just add on unnecessary minutes to this video. So, hopefully, you enjoyed this video. I know there wasn't as much going on this video as there was the last few. Um, if you enjoyed this video, leave a like, subscribe if you are not already. And I look forward to seeing you in the next video. Goodbye.